Okay, good. I thought for a minute there. One, two. Ooh. One, two. I don't even know why I'm pushing it this way. I just know I have to. Oh, okay. Okay, here's my question. Is there a certain set? Maybe I completely missed the section. Because I thought, oh man. So if I'm not, it's not, if it's not here that I'm jumping up from, then where am I? Oh, it is here. Okay, I just spoke too soon. Tom's Expedition Log, 1901. He's not even bothering with months and days now. It's all my fault. Everyone is dead because of me. I took the silver box from its hands. Then I start dreaming of a man made of light. He was coming to take it away from me. He was terrifying. He wanted me to return it to the totem. Close it away where it belongs. When I looked inside the box, I couldn't understand what I saw. It was so dark and beautiful. I felt it escaping. Sorry, was there anything on the other side? No. Okay, for sure no. So... What in the hell is that? Ooh, ooh, ooh. It looks like there's some le lettering on the wall. Okay, one. Yep, nope, no clue. No clue. So we're just gonna have to... Oh, there's literally nothing I can... We can't read the lettering and... Okay, so only choice is down then. question is if we are we going to have any effect okay okay we can jump up here I just want to see how far up this goes, but this is going pretty far up. 
Stopping? Anytime? Nope. You are making, you are exiting the screen on the top left. All right. Can you hear that breathing thing? Am I going to die from this? I don't even know if this is... Assuming I'm gonna die. No, no. I'm so sorry. That's Tom? Tom, what happened to you? Okay. Thing. So we need to. We can't move it this way. Okay, so we're going to have to find the lever to drop that down. I thought it was going to be right there, but nope. No, no, no. Oh, I got it. I got it, and then I dropped. Let's, uh. Read this. Tom's expedition log, 20th of March, 1901. This is part of the totem represent... This part of the to totem, sorry. This part of the totem represents soul. It reminds me a bit of the Chinese symbol, the Chinese yin, yin yang. Crook said soul is above mind. The hand presents body. According to Crook, body is above strength. He said I could hold on to the silver box for now. Uh, soul is above mind, and that is the moon, that moon crescent moon is symbol for soul. Soul is above mind, and the hand represents the body. Body, uh, sorry, I'm definitely going to write that down because if I remember from that weird little puzzle, soul above mind, and then body is above, is above strength. This one is hand, the crescent moon soul. I, I think that one I can remember. So now I'm getting tense, because... Nothing there. Okay. Oh shit, I didn't realize there's a drop. <laughs> Again, with this game, I can't see for crap. I can't. Do I want to go here? Can I even? Because it's just a drop down, if I'm correct. And I imagine if I just drop down here, yeah. Okay, and I can see I when I died there, I just saw the edges of those that stuff. But oh, oh. or I just couldn't make it that way. Oh no, no, this is the edge of this. Oh, the... Oh. Um, I guess we helped Tom. I like how I can't actually drop down. <laughs> oh, wait. 
There's something here. Tom's expedition log. I can't move. I can feel the darkness rooting me. It doesn't want to go back. I can't fix this. I'm sorry. Okay. There's a thing we can press there. Book, uh, whatever that thing is. Okay, so I'm just going to use my mouse here. So this is the soul, which needs to be above mind, and body, which is above strength. Now the question for me is, which one is which? Is this... Is this mind or is this strength? Because both the hands are already above here. I just don't know which symbol is soul and which symbol is... I can still move this. Oh no. It literally it's, it's, it's it means nothing. <laughs> I hit that thing. Oh. Tan's expedition log, 20th of March, 1901. The professor said that this carving shows that the totem is a missing is missing a piece which he calls the protector. It looks like a man with light shining out of him. Oh, I wonder what we are. Yeah, that literally is just to make our way back up there. We don't need that anymore because we got this. Okay, we have a ho ho something. Okay, so I'm gonna s under, under the assumption. How do I know the mind is not the head? Oh shoot, I keep screwing that up. But luckily I can just I can just jump up there. Okay. Sorry, I hear those things and I don't I don't see them there. You want know I'm just gonna make the jump to that spot. If it is there, then oops. The wood is starting to go green with algae. There literally is nothing here. So we have the soul above mind and mind over body. So I'm gonna assume and body over strength. <sighs> Maybe the head one should be really that's a problem. I don't know what strength looks like. The hand is, represents the body, right? And the soul represents the crescent moon. I just don't know. It makes sense. It would make sense, I guess, if the mind was the head over here. So maybe I'm going to go with this one first then. Mm -hmm. 
strength. Okay, so body over strength. Oh, well, I was wondering what was being stopped by. Okay, there's that. I'm sorry. You know what? I there's just that one area with the the, the things, the spikes. Because I feel like if I don't check that out before I do, so that puzzle at the end feels like a the end puzzle. Now, my, my question is: Is this more endgame thing, or is the totem thing my endgame thing? The problem is, I can't... There's nowhere for me to go. I feel like there's... I see a platform. I think I see a platform. All the way over there. But yeah, it's not happening. Okay. I'm gonna have to play the assumption that I need to do the totem first. Let's drop. It's wrong, it's wrong. <laughs> you have sealed in the darkness. You have been cast in stone to remain its eternal garden. Okay, so that was... That was the game. So I don't know what was with the pit at the top there. I couldn't figure it out. Lazy Monday Games, thanks for playing. Okay, and that's it. That is Reveal the Darkness. Um, yeah, main menu. Is there brightness settings on this? No, it's just... <laughs> there we go. So that was Reveal the Darkness. A nice little short exploration game. Um, yeah, it's going to kill me with that top part with the, the whole... I probably missed something there, but at the same time, I just didn't want to continue trying to figure it out. So thank you. For, yeah, I guess there's nothing... Um, that's my thoughts on the game. It's a fun little exploration game. Um, again, I, my main problem is that I had a lot of trouble seeing, particularly when it gets to like the black tar areas, I can't tell the difference between the black of the, of, of platforms and the black of the, 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 the background of everything. So it really threw me off and I think that's the main reason why I was having trouble. Otherwise, I think I'll probably be able to get through it with a bit more ease, with the exception of the puzzles things I was getting confused with. Well, hmm. Again, it was kind of like, where am I going? I can't see where I'm going. Um, but yeah, so everyone died. There's no happy endings. And even your main guy, I mean, we saved the, the world-ish or prevented the world from being destroyed by this weird darkness stuff and our our silent protagonist gets cast in stone <laughs> but nonetheless thank you for liking if you like thank you for commenting if you commented thank you for subscribing if you subscribe thank you for favoriting if you favorited and thank you for simply clicking on this video and until next time guys see ya